This is the iPhone SE 2022. It's one of the more affordable devices in Apple's current lineup, and if you're looking for a cheap iPhone, then you might be considering this one. One of the highlights of Apple's iPhones is that they do come with good camera performance, but given the limitations of the iPhone SE 2022, does Apple's cheapest iPhone have what it takes to give good camera performance? Let's take a look in this video. Alright, so unlike the rest of Apple's iPhone lineup, the iPhone SE 2022 comes with a more basic camera setup consisting of a single 12 megapixel sensor for the main camera and a 7 megapixel sensor for the front camera. Now, since photo quality is a very subjective issue, I just want to show you guys some of the photo samples that I was able to take on the iPhone SE 2022 and show you guys how it performs in general day to day use. Now, one good thing about the iPhone SE's camera software is that it does provide a ton of different options and customizations so users can tweak the camera performance to their liking. With that said though, I chose to use the iPhone SE in a more point and shoot manner and yeah, let's get started. Now, being that this is a single camera, there's no ultrawide lens here, no telephoto or macro lens, unlike on the iPhone Pro models. But for a single main camera, I do think that the iPhone SE still manages to take generally good shots, especially if you have perfect lighting conditions. If you're used to iPhone cameras, then you'll notice some familiar elements with regards to the quality in these photos. In general, iPhone photos tend to have rich contrast, although they do have decent dynamic range. And in general, you're going to get good looking photos with the iPhone SE 2022. Now for some reason, Apple decided not to give the iPhone SE a night mode for its camera despite coming with the A15 Bionic chip. So the phone does have a bit of difficulty in terms of low light photography, which is one consideration to keep in mind, especially for people who are planning to do a lot of low light photos on their devices. Now for video recording, footage shot on the iPhone SE's main camera maxes out at 4K resolution at 60 frames per second. Nor does come with functionality such as slow motion for example, although some features like the cinematic mode found on the more expensive iPhone models are not available here. Alright, so this is a quick sample of the front camera video quality on the iPhone SE. Unfortunately, there's no 4K recording on the SE's front camera, but it still manages to do a pretty good job, especially if you just need it for basic stuff like video calls and some quick selfies for social media. Let me know what you guys think. Alright guys, so that pretty much does it for this quick video. Let me know your thoughts about the iPhone SE's cameras in the comments below. Do you have one with you or are you planning on getting one? Or are you going to get an iPhone with a better camera setup? Don't forget to check out our other videos here on TeamViewer Y. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.